I'm Anu Prakash. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. It has now been more than 100 days since a woman from Detroit went missing in Peru. Now family and friends of Carla Valpeaz are pulling their resources together. They held a fundraiser last night to help with search efforts. Family members say Carla went to Peru back in December for a wedding and has been missing ever since. The family has set up a GoFundMe page to help fund search efforts. You can find a link at WXYZ.com. Police are looking for the driver who hit an ambulance and then took off. Four people are now recovering. It happened Saturday at Linden and Schaefer on Detroit's west side. Police say that after slamming into an ambulance, the driver let a female passenger and a young child out of the car and then left the scene. We're told the ambulance had its lights and sirens on when it was hit. On the heels of Robert Mueller finishing the Russia probe, President Trump is at his Mar-a-Lago resort this weekend, and he had a special guest from Michigan. Kid Rock hit the golf course with the president. The Detroiter posted this picture on Twitter where he described the president as a, quote, great man, so down to earth and so fun to be with. Now for a check of the forecast, let's send it over to 7 First Alert meteorologist Hallie Vogel. We're in pretty good shape for our Sunday. Increasing clouds, so we're not going to be quite as bright as Saturday, but our temperatures will be warmer. We'll be in the 50s for highs. 27 for a low tonight, and the sky gradually clearing. Any chance for rain ending, and again, the best chance will be south of Detroit today and tonight. 42 degrees tomorrow, so we do take a little jump back in temperatures, and then 44 on Tuesday. We do have a nice string of dry days, and that will allow us to warm up to 50 on Wednesday. Upper 50s, Thursday. Thursday and Friday, the mildest days, there's a chance for it, a pretty good chance for showers by the end of the week. Hallie, thank you. The Powerball jackpot is growing again after nobody won the big prize last night. It's now up to an estimated $750 million. The winning numbers were 24, 25, 52, 60, 66, and the Powerball was five. There are two winners who won $2 million and seven people who won a million dollars. None of them is from Michigan. The next drawing is on Wednesday. Good luck. Those are your headlines. Make sure to visit our website, WXYZ.com, and our app for news anytime. Have a great Sunday.